Rumble-bye, tumble-bye, be a poor gentleman. Gather round the roadside and lay your money down. While it's long and short, they the best of every song. For a single paltry penny of the news from London town. songs from the British Isles. Deb sings a lot of songs from the British Isles, but also has, but an, I'm not British. has an American side of the tradition. I don't sound British anymore because I lived here for yes, too long. Yes, you do. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's a New Yorker. I'm a Massachusetts. I'm a, I, can I say it? Never mind. I live in Massachusetts. That could be British. <laughs> well, I live in Shrewsbury, and there is a Shrewsbury in Britain, so... But they get confused when I tell them where it is, because I always say it's west of Boston, and then the Brits get really confused because their Shrewsbury is nowhere west of Boston. Well, Shrewsbury's near Worcester. <laughs> and it's not near Worcester in England. Well, it's about 100 miles from Worcester. So this is this is one you can all join in. And this is written by a, a man from Arkansas, but I used to think it was a traditional Irish song because it's called St. Brendan's Fair Isle, but it's not a traditional Irish song because it's got a barbecue to it. So it was written by a man named Jimmy Driftwood, who's from Arkansas, and it's got a place in it for you to sing. 
goes like this. We sail to St. Brendan's Fair Isle. Fair Isle. We sail to St. Brendan's Fair Isle. Try that. We sail to St. Brendan's Fair Isle. Fair Isle. We sail to St. Brendan's Fair Isle. While you're singing, even if you're chewing on your appetizer, you can still sing. When I was a lad on the Emerald Isle, heard many stories both lovely and wild about the great monsters and dragons that be that swallow the ships when they sail on the sea. Though I was an artist with canvas and paint, sailed with St. Brendan and his jolly saints. We told the good people. Oh, no. We ride 